So guys, in this video I'm going to show you a quick way to get Oxygen OS 11 on your OnePlus device without having to wait for it to come automatically. Of course your device must be eligible for Oxygen OS 11 or the update won't show up. So I'm showing you this on my OnePlus 8 Pro. I did record the whole procedure but there was an issue with the video file so I'm going to have to show you in a different way. As you can see on my OnePlus 8 Pro at the moment, I've got Oxygen OS 11 installed because I just followed this method and updated. I'll show you on the screen now what the phone was showing me whenever I would press update through the settings. So what you need to do, you need to go into the Play Store and search for the app Oxygen Updater. Once you install that app and open it up, you're going to press that continue arrow to the bottom right hand corner. It's going to prompt you to choose your device. It should automatically detect which device you have and have it selected already. Then you're going to press the right continue arrow again and it's going to give you the option of what kind of update you want to do. I always select full update. Then you just press start app and it's going to search for the update file for your phone. For my OnePlus 8 Pro it came up straight away with a 2.9 gigabyte full update file. But for my OnePlus Nord there was no Oxygen OS update yet. Once the update pops up, it shows you the usual update file notes of what's included. And at the bottom of the screen, it will show you the file size and what the file is called. You want to tap the file at the bottom and download it and then just wait. Once the file is downloaded, it's going to verify the download and then it's going to be ready for installation. Now, once it's all verified and installed, you want to close the updater app and go into your settings menu in your phone. Go to where it says system update and you want to press the top right hand gear icon and press local upgrade. And you're going to see the download file that you've just downloaded. Press that file and install it. And it's just going to be like the standard update on your device. You just have to wait it out and wait for it to reboot the system. So I hope that helped you out. And remember to subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Leave a comment down below if this worked for you. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.